So if you look right here, it says solve by completing the square x square minus 8x plus 5 equals to 0. And so we want to comp solve this by completing the square. So first thing I want you to do is go to your calculator, you press mode, then you go down to number 5 and you press equation. It is a polynomial of degree 2, so you press number 3 since it's a quadratic. Now you put in the coefficients, the coefficients would be 1 minus 8 and 5. So you insert 1 for A, minus 8 for B, and you insert 5 for C, and you press E equal. What it will first do is give you the solution. It will give you the answers, meaning it solved the equations first. Because if we click this, you see x is 4 plus or minus root 11. So this is giving us the solution to the equation, but this is not what we want. We don't want this. We want the completed square. We need the minimum value to complete square, and we need the x value at the turning point. Here it is. The x val min is 4. Look what it means right there. If you look at the complete solution right here, see it here? The x value at the turning point is 4, and the x value at the turning point is 4. So this allows you to find the x value at the minimum point. Now, the next thing they like to ask is what is the minimum value? Looking at the solution, the minimum value is minus 11. All you have to do is press equal again and it will give you the minimum y value which is minus 11. That's really cool, right? Minus 11, minus 11. 